Hey guys, it's myself here. Welcome back to the channel. And driver's license and IDs feature is finally here. Apple has enabled this feature in the wallet of your iPhone. You can tap on the plus icon and you can now see the drivers and IDs for states. Now I'm going to go over a few details and try to answer as many questions as possible because you guys do have a few questions over on Twitter. I wanted to give you guys my thoughts on this feature and how Apple plans to roll this out. Everything you need to know basically. As always, if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS news and Apple software updates, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode. Now, as I mentioned, Apple has officially launched the first driver's license in state IDs for wallet. Now, starting with Arizona, as you can see from Apple's newsroom here, Apple will be adding additional states as follow Colorado, Hawaii, Mississippi, Ohio, and the territory of Puerto Rico. So they're going to be adding these at first. Now, Apple did not specify exactly when these will be rolling out. This is a feature that needs approval from local governments, and it's going to take some time for Apple to roll this worldwide and now one thing i do want to mention is the process and how to set this up now if you're in arizona you can actually do this right now you go into the wallet you go over into the plus icon here and then you tap on the driver's license and state id it doesn't matter where you live you will see this option however when it comes to scanning your driver's license or ids to add it to your iphone it will not work if your state isn't supported as of yet so for example i'm in florida it still doesn't work in florida as of yet but i'm gonna walk you through the steps because after Apple did mention and did note all the steps that it will take for the MVD or the DMV or whatever local agency is in charge of driver's license and IDs in your state and how this works. So we have here the first step, which as I mentioned, is to add it to your iPhone and Apple Watch. It will ask you to actually scan your driver's license or IDs in the front, as you can see right there. Then it will ask you to scan the barcode on the back and then it will ask you to take a picture of yourself and this will be submitted to the NVD or DMV as I mentioned or whatever local agency in your region is in charge of the government IDs and driver's license and this will be matched with the image that they have of you at the local DMV right so they will match this image to your image on file for your driver's license and if everything is clear you have your driver's license in or IDs directly on your iPhone and you can access this directly from your Apple Watch as well. You can double tap on the side button to bring this up. When you do have it available, it will show up here just like all your other cards do. And you can go ahead and, you know, just use it as you wish. And there you guys have it. This is everything you need to know. Apple has enabled this feature. Server side, no software update is required. Arizona first. A few additional states will be following here in the next couple of months. And of course, Apple will continue to roll this out entirely through the entire United States. So there you guys have it. Just trying to answer as many questions as I could. Thank you for watching today's video guys and i'll see you on the next one peace